It is the 17th day of July 2014. Many thanks for joining us on KTN Prime. Let's look at the top stories of the day. Our sign language interpreter is Meresha Owiti. Indeed, welcome to the program. We start with some bad news from Western Kenya where 12 pupils from a primary school in Kakamega County will spend the night in hospital after suffering severe burns in an explosion from a botched science experiment. Parents and teachers of Shisango Mixed Primary School in Huisero thronged the hospital after the sad ordeal. KTN's Francis on Tomwa has the details. An eerie silence hangs in the air. Kakamega Provincial General Hospital, forlorn and contrite faces of 12 pupils of Shisango Mixed Primary School. Faces that gave evidence of a morning science experiment gone wrong. It was a horrible morning for the class 4 pupils and their teacher during a science lesson when a fire explosion abruptly ended the learning session. Mwalimu alikuwa anafanya experiment ya kuchunguza mambo ya soil content of humus in the soil na ilibidi lazima atumie moto sasa alikuwa anatumia bana ambayo inatumia spirit na kwa bahati mbaya ikalipuka na ilipolipuka ajali ikapatikana it's the students who told me it is in that class where there is fire so I left the class and when I went, sure, I found that the pupils had banned, the teacher had also banned. And so when we found the pupils and the teachers were frantically trying to call for help. A quick response from teachers helped rescue the boys and girls who were rushed to a neighboring Yomuleche Health Center before being transferred here. The fire, according to teachers, was sparked off when banners which had methylated spirit leaked and exploded into flames as the pupils were in the middle of a class. Doctors at the Kakamega Provincial Hospital said the burns are between 1 to 50 percent, mostly of the faces and hands. The situation, they say, is under control. The pupils are expected to stay for between one and two weeks at the facility before they are discharged. Eleven children from a school who are burnt, uh, sustained burns and uh, two were treated and uh, discharged home. We have admitted uh, nine children. Uh, the severity of burns is between 1 and 15 percent and uh, it is uh, mild. We have visited the children and uh, what we can say is that um, they are in a stable condition and we are happy that we as a county are able to manage this situation. We are not going to refer them outside. Chisango Primary School has a pupil population of about 500 and the facility seems overstretched. The experiment ideally would have been conducted in a laboratory under strict safety measures but was instead done in an open classroom. All the problems in our primary schools, we don't have facilities like laboratories. So I think the teacher had uh, innovated uh, just his own uh, creation of what really the experiment would be all about and he used uh, I've been there and uh, told that he used methylated spirit. Then there was a naked flame and of course it exploded. The incident forced the school to send all the pupils home. Learning for these young ones for now has been disrupted and for the next few days this will be their home.